Hi everybody, we are the Watkins Family Hour. I'm Sarah Watkins. And I'm Sean Watkins, and we are going to be your hosts for the IBMA Awards pre-show here at the Bluegrass Situation. It's the 75th anniversary of Bluegrass, but instead of looking back at the past, we're going to be spending this time looking at the future of Bluegrass, celebrating the emerging artist nominees by watching performances from each of them. Back in, way back in the year 2000, <laughs> uh, Nickel Creek won the Emerging Artist Award. So this is really, really special for us to be able to be a part of this. Stay tuned after the showcase portion of the show for the full award show. Um, there'll be a lot more fun happening then. But before we get started with all of this, uh, Sean and I wanted to share one of our new record, Brother Sister. The song is called The Cure. Let's get to our first nominee. High Fidelity is a traditional bluegrass band that goes in for the deep dive 
uh, with traditional bluegrass. They, they find uh, often forgotten songs from the first generation of bluegrass, uh, but they make them uh, their own. It's really, really cool. Um, performing a song from their new album, uh, which is called Banjo Players Blues, here is High Fidelity. Howdy, we're High Fidelity. We're so honored to be nominated for IBMA's New Artist of the Year. We're here live in the Toonsmith Studio in Goodlettsville, Tennessee, and we're going to do you the song that's uh, the title track off of our latest Rebel Records release. Hope you'll enjoy it. The Banjo Players Blues. <laughs> Or my bones are so if I'm working all day long And nothing else can cheer me best than a good old banjo song I got the mean old banjo blues and I'm for hard to lose All day long you know I sang this song called the banjo player's blues I love to pick and I love to sing, it's happy life to me. My heart goes bang when I hear the ring of a mountain melody. I got the mean old banjo blues and I'm for hard to lose. All day long you know I sang this song called the Banjo Player's Blues. When I go, I want you to know you lost good company. You say that's the last of Banjo Jar, no more you see of me. I got the mean old Banjo Blues, and I'm for hard to lose. All day long, you know, I sang this song called the Banjo Player's Blues. You know, all day long I'm gonna sing this song called the Banjo Players Blues. Carolina Blue is a band that lives up to its name, as it is a bluegrass band, and quite a good one. From Brevard, North Carolina. Fiddler Ainsley Porchek won the Momentum Award at IBMA just two years ago and is an American Grand Master Fiddle Champion. <whistles> Ladies and gentlemen, here is Carolina Blue. <laughs> Mama's got cakes and eggs on the griddle Put away the mule boys, it's too wet to plow Ooh, rain's coming down Ooh, too wet to plow Just up the road lives a gal named Trudy The plays at Banger Claw Hammer style she fell in love with my Uncle Rudy He picks his guitar and he drives her wild Saying, come on boys, get down them fiddles Can't make hay with the rain coming down Mama's got cakes and eggs on the griddle Put away the mule boys, it's too wet to fly Ooh, rain's coming down
Old Sam Stone lives high on the mountain. Got six kids that'll dance around and round. Tonight we're gonna have us a picking and a shouting. I ain't missing nothing if we don't go to town. Saying, come on, boys, get down them fiddles. Can't make hay where the rain coming down. Mama's got cakes and eggs on the griddle. Put away the mule, boys, it's too wet to plow. Hey, how are you? I'm Tom Power. I'm the host of Q on CBC Radio in Canada and on NPR across North America. And uh, I'm also the host of Toy Heart on the Bluegrass Situations Podcast Network, our podcast about bluegrass, where I sit down and talk to bluegrass legends like uh, Del McCurry and Ricky Skaggs and Alice Gerard and Tony Trishka and Alison Brown and Bella Fleck and Jerry Douglas. And I'll have more on that a little bit later on. But yeah, I was asked as part of the IBMA to say a couple of words on behalf of the bluegrass situation. We are really happy to be part of tonight's programming as part of BGS. I wanted to make sure you knew about everything happening here, like BGS's podcast network, where you can discover new audio series, like my show Toy Heart, plus the show on the road, Harmonics with Beth Beers, the breakdown focusing on bluegrass albums. Uh, there's also the video series Shout and Shine, BGS's monthly showcase of black, brown, and indigenous roots musicians. There's also the Whiskey Sour Happy Hour, hosted by co-founder Ed Helms. The Bluegrass Situation is also home to daily in-depth editorial features, playlists, show listings, photography, and so much more, covering folk, bluegrass, Americana, country, blues, and everything in between, including a column by Bluegrass Hall of Famer Neil V. Rosenberg. Subscribe to the BGS newsletter or follow on social media so you can be the first to hear about season two of Toy Heart. Discover so much more at thebluegrasssituation.com. It truly is roots culture redefined. Thanks, Tom. And thanks to all you guys for tuning in to this year's special IBMA Awards pre-show celebrating this year's emerging artist nominees. Let's keep things rolling and uh, introduce our, uh, our next group of nominees. Mile 12 is a band that came out of the Boston music scene and they got recognition, an IBMA Momentum Award in 2017 for their debut record. Their newest record is called City on a Hill and we're going to check out performance at last year's La Roche Bluegrass Festival. <laughs>
Merle Monroe has found that sweet spot between traditional bluegrass and traditional country. A little bit of Merle Haggard and a little bit of Bill Monroe. And, um, you know, in my opinion, if ever there was a sweet spot, that is a sweet spot. Um, their new record is called Back to the Country. Ladies and gentlemen, Merle Monroe. Hey folks, we're Merle Monroe. This is Tim Rabin, Derek Deacons, Matthew Wright, Kevin Richardson. I'm Daniel Grindstaff. And from our debut album on Pine Castle Records, Back to the Country, here's Moving On. One, two, three, four. <laughs> is a lifeline to the nation and men like Will and Sonny keep it moving living like a gypsy always on the go and doing what they best know how to do jamming gears has got to be a fever cause men become addicted to the grind takes a special breed to be a truck driving man with a steady hand to hold that low behind big wheels rolling big wheels rolling moving on I'm going, and Bob and Sonny keep on moving on. A good hot cup of coffee waiting up ahead, and the rhythm of the highway hums along. Jamming gears has got to be a fever, cause men become addicted to the grind. Takes a special breed to be a truck driving man with a steady hand to hold that low behind. Big wheels rolling, big wheels rolling, moving on. After this show, you'll want to head on over to the IBMA Bluegrass Music Award Show, where there will be three very, very special inductees into the Bluegrass Music Hall of Fame. J.T. Gray, the owner of the World Famous Station Inn, the Johnson Mountain Boys, and the New Grass Revival, all three huge players in the bluegrass Just, community and in yeah. our lives. Yeah, monumental figures that, that just really helped shape the, the, the state of bluegrass. Sense of harmony, yeah. the, the community, oh my goodness. Yeah. Um, there'll be more awards and there'll be more performances. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, just click that link below and follow it to the full IBMA Awards show right after this. Thompson Guitars is excited to support IBMA's Emerging Artist Showcase. Thompson's luthiers focus on the handcrafted details, creating a light and lively guitar that shines whether on your own or with the band. From their factory and sister's organ, their team carries on the legacy of Preston Thompson, producing a modern vintage tone for future generations of bluegrass players. Discover more at pktguitars.com. Wrapping things up for us is Appalachian Roadshow. Who are going into this evening with a whopping five nominations. Wow. That's amazing. So without further ado, here are Appalachian Roadshow. I am just another wayworn pilgrim plodding toward Jerusalem Looking for a happy home in heaven far beyond the valley dim I have nothing but my faith in Jesus and his everlasting grace but I know that ere the sun is sinking I will have a resting place I am just a pilgrim 
Seems I've traveled all along, along Just a little body body passing Through a world that's not my home, not my home. But, but I'm not discouraged If something tells me I'm in heaven Where my pain I got I to, get head to, to heaven I will be a million Day by day I look to Him for guidance And I know I'll never fail Day by day His gentle hand is leading And His love will ever prevail Though I'm just a lowly wayworn pilgrim And a beggar too may be In that land of many mansions yonder there will be a place for me I'm just, just a pilgrim Seems I travel all alone, all alone. Just a nobody body passing Through a world that's not my, not my home But I'm not discouraged Something tells me I'm in Well, folks, that's our show. But stay tuned. Click the link below, and you can watch the, the whole show, the IBMA Bluegrass Music Awards show. It's going to be a great night. If you are interested in what the Watkins Family Hour is doing, you can find us in all the usual places uh, on social media. Um, and check out our new record, Brother Sister. Um, we also are on Patreon. Twice a month we're doing live stream shows for, um, for any and all who want to come see. Yeah. Uh, we need to thank IBMA and the Bluegrass Situation for putting this whole showcase together and making this possible. An extra special thanks to our sponsor, Preston Thompson Guitars, for helping make all of this possible. Uh, and for more information on all the bands that you watched here tonight, don't forget to visit bluegrasssituation.com. Good night, everybody. Have a great night. <laughs>